What is going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So this week's video is starting off very, very different, but I am on my way to the Darts Referee Open. I just stopped off, get myself a nice foot on, and I have about two hours of driving left before I get to the hotel. It's Friday, it's Jack's birthday, so go to his channel, wish him happy birthday, drop it down in the comments. Just wish him happy birthday. This is the big 3-0, so it's the same age as me, you know? Right, let's carry on with the drive, here we go. Okay, so we are at the travel lodge. Room number 32, it doesn't matter because by the time you see this, I'm not gonna be here. But let's have a look around. Lovely mirror. Nice big open room. Nice little TV, another mirror. Nice little shower and toilet, another mirror. Three mirrors in one room. All checked in now. I think I'm going to have a lie down, chill out, go on social media for a bit, have a shower, and then head wherever the club is. It's up in that direction somewhere. Have a throw. Wish Jackie boy happy birthday. And there we go. We're at the Dance Referee Open. So we got there nice and early around 11 o'clock. It was really quiet. Probably see a few familiar faces here. And then as the time went on, it packed right out. And I think the tournament was full to the brim. There was a reserve list, so it was really good. Now, this is my first game. And this game is against uh, Richie Sharat. I hope I'm saying that right. Yeah, I had an awesome game against Richie. Really nice bloke. I think personally I could have played a lot better than I did. And this is the end of the match just here. Totally messed our shot up. Went for a single one, hit a treble one, and wanted six at the end of that. And then Richard stepped up 20 for double top. Takes the game 3 0. So I was a bit devil with that. Once the game had finished, I thought I'd go watch Dynamite Darts in his game down on the opposite side of the room on board one. Yeah, Danny had a really good game. Hopefully he's got a video coming out about it. If he has, the card will be in one of the corners. Swiftly after, I had my second game against Ed Butters. Another really, really good game. I felt like I was in the GDL because we were all playing around the same level. You know, I could have won, they could have won. It was always back and forth and it was really, really good. Again, Ed, such a lovely man. You know, really, really nice. Little talk about the scoreboard, but they. Here we go. I'm up for my last throw now. Missed the double top anyway. That explains it. Ed steps up. Pangs in a double 18. Another 3 0 defeat for me, but they. After that, old pop of pulled six, just a couple of steps down to watch the old darts referee have a game. He said he was retiring and he wasn't going to play darts for a couple of months. And then we rock up and he's playing in the tournament. So, third game against Andrew Cook. There we go, took the first leg with double. Double two. Quite pleased with myself. I was happy just to get one leg. And then I took second leg with double five. Confidence is beaming, as you can see. <laughs> and then the last leg. I wanted 10 again, I think, another double five. 
a bang than it is first start. Andrew though, lovely chap. Really, really nice boy. Brilliant to have a game with him. And then this is the very end of the last game against Kyle Bloomfield. Kyle actually went on to become the quarter finalist at the entire tournament. And as soon as he found the treble 20, the game was over for me. So in the first leg, uh, he didn't find it, you know, I'll be honest, he couldn't find the treble 20. And then towards the end of the first leg, he found our treble 20 and bang, after he hit, what, hit one dart in there, it was a 180 on the next throw and he checked out straight away. And I gotta be fair, I had an absolute ass kicking. <laughs> that was an assault. Now into the final, the final Steve Burton against a local legend, Tony Lincoln. Now Steve is a card holder. What I've decided to do is put in some of the highlighted clips from this and that's Tony taking out a 117 I think. And now Tony stepping up for a 158. So treble 20, for treble 20, for double 19, boosher. Next leg, next clip now is Steve stepping up and he wanted a uh, one five eight as well so travel 20 travel 20 goes for the 19 just outside and that was the next leg after after tony had done it it was incredible tony stepping up now i think this is the last the last leg of the final yeah he misses double top there and steve comes up here the score is four three And there we go. Shot. We just jump now from this into the presentations, and I'll chat with you at the end of the video. So there we go guys, hope you've enjoyed this video, I had an awesome, awesome time with the boys and yeah, can't wait to do it again next year. Thank you very much for watching guys, I am still in the travel lodge, I haven't even made my way home yet. It's 10 o'clock in the morning on Sunday and yeah, I shall be leaving in about an hour, making my way home. What an awesome weekend it's been. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you guys next week for another video. Peace out, stay safe, keep it sharp.